All right, so hey guys, uh, we're here with a video. Uh, so this is just going to be like how to make like a like a regular song or beat or whatever. So this is going to take a long time because you know for me it takes a long time for to make music, especially to make a good one. So I got this one right here. So yeah, also, um, before I start the video, this, the fan is, like, kind of loud, so, yeah, it's gonna, be, it's gonna get annoying, but, the, the, um, I put this, this, uh, thing on the fan, cause it wasn't working, so, now it's just loud and annoying, so, yeah, we got the sample, uh, the, the tempo is 130, so, yeah, um, and I have, some packs here. I made my own because I thought it was going to work, but it didn't work. So, um, yeah. And here we have that. What I do sometimes with my songs or the songs is or music. I, I don't know. Is that I just uh, I layer this and I just layer it down a little bit and may have it a little bit more taste. Add some reverb to it. So that at the end, when the song like ends, it has that like cool feel to it. Okay, we gotta fix that. Um, uh, and sometimes it so it can sound better. I put some girl speed to it. Uh, you play it. You put the single curve. speed okay well okay that actually sounds good well, okay okay I'm just gonna keep that so So you put to have half speed. Now, if you know how to do that, you open it. So it actually just shows this, but then you uh, click this arrow right here and then you do it like. Oh wait, yeah, you go to the arrow and then it just shows that. But yeah, so so yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna go to like a random pack. I'm just gonna go to the one I made. But uh, these are the two kicks that I made, or the ones I like, or usually play on my songs. Let's put the let's put try to put this one. Okay, yeah, okay. So yeah, go to two. Or just geez, I don't know. So yeah, we got my kick here and so yeah. <laughs> so Wait, hold on. Actually, I might not put the um girl speed to it. It's just uh, I don't know, cause I don't know. I just don't want to put it in. So also, also, what I do is that when I a lot of people probably don't do this, or I mean, probably some people do, but I usually to to know to make it sound better, I usually just. You know, just put the sample there and then play it and remove it. So yeah, that's not bad. So um, we're gonna get a snare or uh, yeah, snare. And these are the two I use. I'm gonna put this one.
Okay, that sounds okay, that sounds better. Alright, get a hi hat. Doesn't sound bad. Usually instead of just you know having like every like two steps. Uh, I usually just put it like to four. If it sounds so like this. I put uh, sometimes I always don't have it like you know like each two steps I change it a little bit so it can actually go with like the sample and stuff because usually um if you listen to my songs and probably don't but uh, on SoundCloud um usually I have the hi hats um go with the sample so yeah I mean I mean some song I don't know but yeah. So yeah, that's that's okay, I guess. And then when you get your 808, I might go with this. I'm gonna go with this one. So. And then you just drag that. Also, so um, when it does that thing where, like you know, this like so it's like this. You want to put cut itself so it doesn't sound bad. So yeah, that's why you use it. sound bad um also uh if you want to get like like good um like nice loops or something or just loops like or just loops in general or some stuff like that like effects or sound effects or sound i don't know um i'm gonna put uh, a website in the link but you have to make an account which is not that hard really you know but it's called um L looper man if you don't have it then you should probably you should probably get it not bad so now okay that's just a running clip I want to add a clap I think this one goes good as well now this is what I learned from some like uh, uh like um some like Beat YouTubers, like YouTubers that make beats, they usually add the clap first and then the, the snare. That's what I learned, which is um pretty cool, but yeah. But usually I lower them down, so. good with mixing I, I just lowered it down because I don't yeah doesn't sound bad uh next you want to add like a open hat I like this one uh actually added the forget
<laughs> Wait, it, uh, is it even record? Oh, okay, it's recording. So, this is what we have so far. Okay, so, let's add some of this. I don't know, but it's pretty cool. I usually like add some stuff. Uh, so this is, uh, I want to add some of that stuff. I don't, I don't know, but yeah, EQ. If you some variety to the hi-hats so let's go to the hi-hats you want to right click piano roll and then what I usually do or what I saw from some producers they drag it like they drag the hi-hats actually I don't, I don't think I should do it with this one so you want to just click And uh, I did this on my recent song. I actually went to to drums uh, to to put this in the cow butt, the, the cow thingy, and I'm gonna copy and paste that with the snare. Uh, let's just go to EQ. There we go. So yeah. Um. Also, also. Um. The, another point I think you should do is save it. But I don't have the full version, so yeah. Does it sound like when it's even lower? Jeez. Okay. Um. Okay. That sounds. Okay. So it's actually kind of getting good. But it's still bad, but so if you want to, you can add a chance. No. But in my opinion, I usually don't put chance, so I don't know why I made that. But f you know, why not? Decide, decide this one. like change a little bit so maybe, so I just lower this down and yeah with that I don't know what to do with that also another cool thing uh you can actually like 
lower the thingy. I don't know what's called, but you, by doing this. So. It's not bad, but it's not the best, you know? It's not the worst, it's not the best, so, yeah. Alright, so you got your stuff, you got all the stuff, you wanna, you wanna tap this and then put it here. Still kind of loud. Anyway, so yeah, you did that. Want to right click, split by channel. So, you want to right click, uh, kick. I'm gonna have the kick go first. Hi hats go here. I have the 808 go second. Okay, so now since you laid everything, uh, it was just something like this. <laughs> So, you wanna, you wanna loop this, usually I loop this like three times, or like, like two times, for, okay, for this, for, for the video, we're gonna do it three times, so, yeah. <laughs> So after the second one, we're gonna put the eight away on the second track because it's uh, almost like ten seconds. But so. Sorry, that was my phone. Um. Oh. Sorry. I wanna see if it's okay. Good, because usually that's what happens to me all the time. So if you wanna know how to like you know like con like you know copy and paste, you wanna like um click this, drag it, and then Control B. So yeah, Control B. It's not Control V. So yeah, and if you don't wanna use that, then then click on this brush, and click it. Uh, just click something, and then click it, and then Control B. So yeah. <laughs> Everything else. Uh, here. Uh, I'm just gonna add everything else. So let's get the open hats. All right. So. Uh. We're back, and I just um, put everything where it is, so yeah, we're just gonna play it.
long pause. You know that in songs they always have those long pauses. I'm not trying to be funny. I'm just saying. I'm just being honest. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm just gonna play the full song. Um, before. No, I'm just gonna play. You know, you know, have a nice day. You just want to go to a file and then export and then MP3 and then or wave. I don't know. You, you can choose either one. So yeah, that's it. Wait. Also, before this video ends, you gotta have a long pause. So it can sound like this. So yeah, it can sound cool. <laughs>